I'm Reese and welcome to the kitchen. We're in my kitchen in Dallas and today I'm going to show you how to make stuffed bell peppers. I stuff mine with beef, tomatoes, etc. You'll see. I don't use rice. I try to do a little bit low carb version but you can add rice if you like to. So let's get these started. The ingredients you'll need today you'll need bell peppers. I'm stuffing three of them. You'll need an onion, you'll need some tomato paste, I'm using some roasted garlic, you could use regular garlic if you like to, you'll need some olive oil, some salt, some pepper, a pound of ground beef, some diced or crushed tomatoes with the juice, whichever you like best, some fresh parsley, and some Italian seasoning. The equipment that you'll need, you'll need a skillet, I'm using a cast iron, you can use whichever is your favorite. You'll need a roasting pan to set your bell peppers in to put them in the oven. You'll need a measuring cup, you'll need a spoon, you'll need a chopping board, a knife, I'm going to use a smaller one to cut the top of my bell peppers and a larger one to chop and you'll need some measuring spoons. Okay, to get this started, I have first preheated my oven to about 350, and now I am going to turn this my skillet on over medium heat, and I'm going to put in about a tablespoon of olive oil, and I have a fourth of a cup, uh, I mean a fourth of an onion, a large onion, chopped up. And I'm going to put that in there. And now I'm just going to let this get nice and soft and a little bit brown caramelized to give it some really good flavor. So while we're doing that, let me show you how to cut the bell peppers. Okay, got my bell pepper here. I'm going to do three. So I'm going to just cut along the top here, give it a nice wide opening so you have lots to stuff. And it, mine never turn out all that pretty. <laughs> I'm not the best cutter, I guess. So just, it'll be stuffed so you really don't have to worry about it. So you're just going to take it out. There's your top. There's the inside, so just clean it out a little bit. You don't want any seeds. So you just clean it out, scrape it out, put that in your compost pile. So you'll do that with each of your peppers. And then I take the good part around the top. You'll see, you have it all the way around. And I chop it up. And I'm going to add this to my onion as soon as I get it all chopped up. My onions and peppers are cooking away. You'll see my onions are starting to brown. So now I'm going to add one pound of ground beef. You could also do this with pork. And you're going to salt and pepper it to taste. And let it brown. My meat is now brown, so I'm going to add two cloves of roasted garlic and stir that around. And I'm going to add about a cup and a half of diced tomatoes. And one tablespoon fresh parsley. 
And I'm also going to add one teaspoon of Italian seasoning. And I'm going to let this cook for a while. Once it settles down, add one tablespoon of tomato paste into your cooking meat and let it cook out. I've let my meat and tomatoes and all the goodies cook for about five minutes. You see it's very hot. And I've got my peppers here. And I'm just going to take them and stuff them full of the meat mixture. And then once I've got them stuffed, I will stick them in the oven. That's my mom talking to Jackson in the background. Tastes good. So I'll fill each one of them and I'll stick them in the oven for about 45 minutes to let them cook. My bell peppers are now finished cooking. I've taken them out of the oven, let it cool down just a little bit. Beautiful, they'll be juicy on the inside and really yummy. I hope you enjoy it.